Hey everyone, it's Sarah here today. I wanted to address some of the comments I've been receiving about the authenticity of my stories. So let's dive in. Comment one, this story seems too good to be true. I think she's making it up. I understand where you're coming from, but I can assure you that all my stories are based on my real life experiences. I believe in being honest and genuine with my audience. Comment two, she's just trying to get more views by exaggerating her stories. It's not about the views for me. It's about sharing my journey and connecting with others who may be going through similar experiences. Exaggeration is never my intention. Comment three, I've seen similar stories on other channels. Is she just copying them? I take inspiration from various sources, like many creators do but I always make sure to add my own unique perspective and personal touch to my stories. Comment for her stories are too dramatic to be true. She must be faking it. Life can be dramatic sometimes, and my stories reflect that. I can understand why it may seem hard to believe, but I stand by the truth in my storytelling. Comment five, she's probably just seeking attention with these stories. Sharing personal stories can be vulnerable, but I believe in the power of storytelling to create connections and empathy. Attention is not my goal. Authenticity, comment six, I think she's fabricating these stories for fame. Fame is not what drives me. I share my stories to inspire and inform others, not for personal gain. My priority is to be genuine and relatable to my audience. Comment I7, I don't buy her stories. They sound too rehearsed. Rehearsal is necessary to ensure clarity and coherence in storytelling. I want to deliver my stories in the best possible way to resonate with my audience. Comment, Blake, I used to be a fan, but now I doubt the authenticity of her stories. I value all feedback, positive or negative. I can understand your concerns, and I hope to address them by staying true to my values and experiences in my co comment nine. She's probably just making up these stories for money. Money is not my motivation for sharing my stories. I believe in the impact of storytelling on connection and understanding. My priority is always off. Comment ten. Her stories are too perfect to be real. She's definitely lying. Perfection is not the goal of my storytelling. I aim to share my imperfect, real experiences to connect with others on a deeper level. Trust in my truth is a thank you all for your comments and feedback. I hope this clears up any doubts about the authenticity of my stories. Remember, storytelling is about connection and understanding. See you in the next video.